I'm riding through your hood, east side, be with me. So the pole at his chromosome, meet with me. I'm back. Any nigga got a problem with that? I just so. I just so. When I made bubble dang bubble. I'm still in the streets, nigga. In the streets, nigga. In the streets, nigga. Yeah. Yeah. My motherfucker. What's good, YouTube? It's your boy T, you know, back with another video, man. And tonight, we're going to be talking about Mo3. All right, so look, man. Now, very quick video, right? Because a lot of people, hey, plug your ears. I mean, just a lot of them, they mad as hell. And that's because his music been doing better than theirs, and he been dead. So, like, it be like that sometimes. People just be better than you. Just like he's better than this guy that they're saying that he stole his style from. I don't know. He just came home from jail and uh, one of Mo3 Ops just posted him saying how it's time to show people where the real sound came from and all of this. You know, just doing any and everything to try to get back at Mo3 finally. Because as I said, he's been dead but still been doing better than everybody else. So now it looks like he's about to start pushing the guy who's, uh, who sounds like Mo3 or who Mo3 sounds like. I don't know who came first. I, I can't lie, though. They definitely sounded like it. And, and the guy's pretty good. But this is the thing, though, you know. It really don't matter who was rapping like that first. I'm going to be honest with you. Because nobody don't really care. If he created the style... Good for him, you know. I mean, Jay-Z, one of the greatest rappers of all time. Have you ever heard his song, Takeover, where he's dissing Nas? You see, Jay-Z said, so yeah, I sampled your voice. You was using it wrong. You made it a hot line. I made it a hot song. And the song he's referring to is his song called Dead President. If you didn't know, that was Nas, Nas' voice on the hook. Jay-Z sampled Nas' voice, and that's how he came up with the song Dead President. And what Jay-Z is saying, okay, that was your line, but I made a hit off of it. Nobody don't care about your line, dawg. You was doing it wrong. I made it better. I really did. And that's the same thing right here. If the guy made up the flow again, good for him. Congratulations. And I'm not even trying to be funny because that, that is a nice flow. But it's just too bad that Mo3 did it better than you. He took it and actually built talent around it. He not just rapping fast. Matter of fact, I'm going to be honest. Nobody don't even really care about Mo3 when he be rapping fast like that. I mean, it's good. I like it because I like rapping. But if you pay attention to Mo3's music, None of his songs where he's really rapping, rapping, is getting viewed. He didn't blow up because of the fast flow. He blew up because he made good songs, you know. He's talented. Where is your flow in Broken Love, you know? That has over 100 million views. Where is that flow in everybody? It has over 100 million views. Where is that flow on slide on him? Where is that flow on the song with Moray? Matter of fact, he used that flow on Shotters Forever. I know for a fact he used it on uh his song called They Can't. They can't mess with me. They can't mess with me. And even though that song called as hell, that's one of the most least listened to songs on the album. So that should tell you something right there. People are not coming to Mo3 to listen to that flow. And I, where's that flow? 219, where's that flow? All the way down, where's that flow? Outside, where's that flow? Because I'm trying to figure out, right, even if he did steal the flow, let's say he stole the hell out that flow, right? Why ain't that flow in any of his biggest songs? Because nobody cares about it. Another Jay-Z quote. Y'all could tell I really fuck with Jay-Z, huh? They say they made hoes. Okay, make another hole. Meaning, if that flow made Mo3, right? Okay, go make another three. 
I want to see hundreds of millions of views with this flow. Well, he only blew up after he died. Nope. Try again. Broken Love was trending number one on YouTube when he was alive. Alive and well. And I know you mad about that. But anyway, man. How y'all feel about this? Let me know in the comment section, bro. Like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification bell, man. Hey, man. Follow me on Instagram. At TZFBaby252. It's crazy because everybody that was around Mo3, like this guy has pictures and everything with Mo3. Used to be in the studio and all. His lyrics be hitting more day by day when you think about it, man. Broken love, everybody, how he can't trust people, people snaking him, people turning on him. I mean, literally, everybody that was around him started rocking with his op. And this and him. But on Lil Mo 3, I'm gone. Nigga, I'm cut though, don't be jealous, nigga. Fuck you, child, man. What? Trey, walk him down. Get down. Prolific. Ayy. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street. Bitch, I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street, bitch. I'm in these streets. Fuck this in the street.